after a busy couple of months, finally got some time to ride. Let's ride. What's going on everybody? Today finally got some time to ride my bike. It's been a couple of months. I've been busy with the projects, of course. Um, but I forgot how therapeutic it is to ride a motorcycle. So today I rode my bike. This is a 2015 Street Glide. Uh, other, other than the 14-inch uh, bars and exhaust and a special tune, bone stock. And I leave it like that because I know I'm a rider. I'm not a shore. You know, I like to ride. I don't care what people uh, have on their bikes. Uh, I do have custom bikes, uh, but this one right here, I'll keep stock as possible. If you ride, then you know what I mean. But while I was riding today, I was also um, I also wore my 21.5 Brave Star, uh, and then I thought maybe I should you know, make a video of what I don't like about the 21.5. If you've seen some of my videos, you know I love the 21.5 from Brave Star. There are many reasons why I love it, and I've already made a video of that. Um, this one in particular is, you know, just being realistic, right? It doesn't matter how good things are. It doesn't matter how expensive things are or whatever the cost may be. Um, you have to have things you don't like about it and I want to talk about that because I think that applies to you if you're going to if you're thinking about buying a salvage jeans heavy one like 21.5 like this one right here uh, from Brave Star I think you should know what those things are that I don't like so that maybe I'll give you a little bit of a time to decide or when you get it finally then you know what to expect now each of us will have different experiences when it comes to salvage jeans, how they break in, how they are, you know, hanging on your waist, a lot of those things. But this one is mine, and I hope it helps you make a decision on whether you should get a 21.5 21, 21 uh, ounces Japanese salvage from Brave Star. Here we go. Today I'm going to smoke a decade from Rocky Patel. Um, small size cigar but I think uh, it's perfect for me right now anyways uh, just gonna enjoy so grab your cigars if you do smoke grab a couple of drinks whatever have you and then sit down relax and then have a chat with me love the cigars uh, I had a good ride today I essentially went around the island and you know, just because, right? Like I said, I don't get to ride motorcycle much, but when I do, I do ride long. In case you're wondering, yes, I still do order a variety pack from Famous Smoke, and this is one of them, Rocky Patel. De decade um, really good in my opinion right again not a cigar review I just want to share that with you so what about the 21.5 Brave Star I don't like well first a quick review of what I like about it right it's a it's an accessible salvage jeans that Brave Star make from LA using Japanese salvage for about hundred fifty dollars you can get uh, quality denim quality salvage denim um, in comparing to, comparing to some of the more expensive salvage like the you know expensive ones like five hundred to a thousand dollar right I think you get the same quality it's great I love it I'm a proponent of it uh, their sizing is somewhat true uh, and then I'll go over that because uh, my 14.5 is true to size. And then this one right here did some crazy things when I finally washed it, right, for the first time. I have a lot of things I like about the 21.5. And I can't really say anything wrong with it. But there are a few things that are irritating the hell out of me. And I hope you understand. So first... 
because it's made out of heavy-duty selvage, it is hard to put on. I'm still waiting for the time that it will break in. I'm still waiting for the time that it's going to be soft, according to other reviews out there that have had their 21.5 ounce Brave Star for some time. I don't know how long that is. Uh, I've probably worn mine less than 100 times and washed it once before. But it is still hard to put on because it's heavy duty denim a and it's agonizing to put on. I know you should be patient when you put on, buy and put on heavy duty jeans because it will pay off down the road, right? As it forms and molded to your body, then it will become soft and more comfortable and then it's probably going to be one of the best jeans or best denim selvage that I own. And because it is stiff, uh, and when I washed it, I was expecting it to loosen up a little bit, right? Um, I got the size that is a little bit tight anyways in the beginning, but when I washed it the first time, I was surprised that it shrunk a little bit. Now the last button on the top, the, the you know, the button on the top of the jeans, I am having a hard time uh, closing it or clasping it. Um, hey, maybe I gain a few pounds, I have no idea. I checked this morning, I still weigh the same, my waist is still the same, nothing's changed. So it really is the jeans and it, it's so hard to, to clasp that I just left it out as I was driving and because I left it out as I was uh, riding my motorcycle, um, the top was digging into my stomach. No matter how upright I rode the bike, uh, it was just digging on my stomach. And so that is one of the dislikes I have, it's just you know, because of the heavy duty, it's hard to button up. I wasn't able to take videos uh, because I was, I just wanted to ride the day and enjoy that. Um, and like I said, during the ride, I thought of a few things to talk about in this video, my dislikes about the 21.5 Brave Star. So the next one is probably more like uh, specific to riding motorcycles. Um, because of the way you ride the motorcycle where your feet is on the pegs, um, your knees are bent up, you know, and the jeans are so hard and, and a little bit tighter on my legs that it actually created marks, uh, red, red marks, behind my knee because that's where it's bunching up when I, my knees are, are bent while I'm riding. So, you know, it's uncomfortable after a while. I mean, you've been riding for about an hour and then you get off the bike and it's really uncomfortable. Uh, again, maybe specific to riding motorcycles. I don't know how it is riding a car a long ways, but I think the difference is that in, in a car or a truck, I can extend my, my legs. So the one I have is a size 34. Um, I normally wear a size 34 but my experience with the 14.5 i wanted it to be a little bit loose so i didn't get the 32 because i know that i would have a hard time fitting it with 32 so i have a size 34 in in uh, 21.5 and also it's a regular taper so uh, a little bit tight tighter than i'm used to um you know if it doesn't have elasticity it's 100 percent cotton the next reason why I dislike the 21.5, the heavy duty salvage from Brave Star is because if you live in Hawaii, it is hot as hell. And something like this, something thick like this, uh, you know, vintage, heritage, it's good, it's cool and everything. But if you live in Hawaii, and again, I'm not complaining, it is freaking hot. You know when you have a heavy duty pair of jeans on and that's probably why most of us don't wear any jeans just wear shorts uh, but I will never ride my motorcycle with with shorts lastly because the 21.5 is quality including the stitches that uh, Brave Star has done and used in creating the jeans um, it's difficult to fold you know, I bought a little bit longer because I like folding my selvage jeans. I made a whole video about why I fold it. So if you want to see that, go to my channel. 
uh, but it's, it's difficult to fold. And uh, of course, once you fold it to a certain extent, you want to leave it there and, and, and then not move it, right? But it's, it's difficult to fold. Two folds is all I need to create the fold that I want. But because it's so freaking tough that I had to do it, you know, put my socks on first, put this, the jeans, uh, put and then fold it while I'm trying to put it on. <laughs> but once you get it done, it's over. You just leave it there until the next wash, uh, and then it'll just create uh, creases there, so you know where to fold it again after that. Those are my dislikes about the 21.5. I think it's uh, realistic, right? Uh, observation of the uh, pair of jeans. I love the 21.5. Like I said, guys, I have a list of things on the reason why I love the 21.5 from Brave Star. Um, is it comparable to my Ironheart uh, jeans? 21 ounces, maybe. Um, is it comparable to a 25 ounce iron heart? Maybe, I made a comparison on another video, but the price difference, you can't really compare it, right? Iron heart is at a different level, in my opinion. This video is not about comparing the iron heart and the Brave Star. Uh, if you wanna see the comparison, then you can go back and search for it and find the video. Uh, maybe I'll do another one uh, during the breaking process of my iron heart. But this is about the Brave Star. Other, other than that, that's really all I have. Hopefully it helps you make a decision on whether that's the, that's the jeans that you want to venture into and buy. If, if you ask me, of course I'll say go ahead and do it because the prize is like freaking amazing. 150 bucks, you cannot beat that in my opinion, right? So you have a great day. Thank you very much for watching. Aloha.